Hey, we're here at Darn Tough Vermont at Interbike 2012 and uh, just showing you the new light cushion sock. Uh, this is our light cushion. It's a spring 2013 arrival. And um, what we've done here is typically if you're a road biker or a road runner and you wear a really tight uh, foot conforming shoe, uh, kind of by necessity you have to wear an ultralight or a mesh sock, otherwise anything else and it'll feel very stuffy and your foot will be really crowded. So to sort of solve that dilemma we've come out with a light cushion sock. Um, so we've taken the um, sort of our, our paradox of having uh, cushion with very low bulk, uh, even one step further, um, by using an even finer yarn. So we used a 17 and a half micron yarn. Um, it's a super fine yarn. Uh, the rest of our line uses a 21 and a half micron yarn. So this is a longer, stronger, finer yarn that allows us to knit the sock to the same high density. We have the highest density knitting in the industry at 1441 stitches in a square inch. Um, so we're known for having that really dense terry loop cushioning. And by using this finer yarn, we're able to still have that, but with an even lighter weight to it overall. So this sock's about half the wool yarn weight of the regular cushion socks. So what you end up with is a cushion sock that'll provide cushioning and padding um, mile after mile all day in the saddle um, without feeling too stuffy or bulky in your shoe. So it's uh, kind of the best of both worlds. So if you're you know, a road biker and typically you couldn't you know, wear a cushion sock, finally there's a cushion sock that will fit into your shoe without overcrowding it. Um, so we're really psyched on this. It comes in um, both a quarter length here and in a no-show. So the no-show height here, so it has a little bumper on the back to keep the sock from falling down into your shoe. And that's a wedge here? I'm sorry? A uh, cut, there's a special cut here. Yep, it's a, what are we calling it, anatomical um, cuff, so yeah, this keeps the sock from falling down, and then it has a little pad here so it keeps the tongue from rubbing on the front of your foot, um, so there's no rubbing. Uh, these socks have our true seamless knitting technology, so there's uh, basically uh, undetectable toe seam across the top, it's uh, totally flat stitch, so there's no rubbing or hot spots in your shoe, um, which is very important. And the other new socks, um, for Interbike is uh, these these two styles here. This is the Road Warrior here on the right, and these are the Herringbone socks here on the left. So these are uh, just new styles of our popular um, three-quarter crew bike stock that we introduced last year at Interbike. Um, it's been really successful for us, and so we've just introduced some new, uh, nice, kind of fun, colorful styles uh, for that. So. So things are going really well, you know, Darn Tough Vermont is, uh, all the socks are made by us in Vermont, in-house, we make them all ourselves, so the quality control is just through the roof, um, we're the only sock with an unconditional lifetime guarantee, so it's as simple as that, no questions asked, no strings attached, no time limits, um, for whatever reason, if the sock is in two pieces or has a pin-sized hole in it, you can send it back for either a replacement pair or for your money back, uh, for life. So. It's uh, pretty remarkable, there's nothing else like that, and uh, the reason we're able to do that is because of all these things, because of the, the high density knitting, the quality of the yarns, um, and the fact that we make it all in-house, um, so you know we can make sure the quality is you know, 100% all the time and nothing slips through the cracks at all. Um, so the company's yeah. doing great, we grew uh, over 80% last year. Uh, first and second quarter of this year have been up over 40% for us, so what that means is just uh, more jobs in Vermont and uh, the small town in Northfield where we're based, so it's a, it's a good thing for everybody. And uh, yeah, and we're just super psyched to be here. It's our second Interbike show and uh, the response has been really good to the socks and we're happy to be back. Great. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you.